Hello everyone, welcome to the Earnest Fashion Academy. Welcome to my channel. My name is Justice, Creative Director of the Earnest Fashion Academy. Okay, without wasting much of the time, in this video I want to show you how to sew two types of world pockets. Okay, we have the single world pocket and the double world pocket. Okay, stay tuned, please subscribe. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and share. Let's get started. Okay, I, I have some pieces here with me. This is assumed to be the main area where you're fixing your world pocket. It could be a trouser, it could be a shirt, it could be a jacket, it could be a skirt, wherever you want to fix your world pocket. We assume that this is all we need for the world pocket. Now we're going to have two pieces of this nature. Um, the, the mouth of the world pocket is about five inches. So we have two pieces here that is wider than the mouth of the world pocket, at least by half inch, but this is half, more than half inch, okay? At least by half inch. It should be, it could be more than half inch up to an inch, it's still okay. Now we have another piece that is going to serve as the pocket itself in case you need it to be a um, complete pocket, not just the design. This will serve as the pocket that will be under the mouth of the world pocket or inside the, um, the trouser or the skirt or wherever you're fixing it. Okay, so what we're going to do now for stability, we're going to stir the wrong side of the world, um, the pocket area. So we're going to measure where we're going to fix the pocket area and then use our SD. You could, you could use an SD or, or a paper stay to stir it. So we're going to stir this area. We're probably going to stir these two pieces. All right. Okay, welcome back dear soulmate. Now I've ironed este at the wrong side of my fabric or my garment, wherever, whatever I'm working with. This is the wrong side I've ironed the um, este and this is the two pieces that will be at the mouth of the world pocket. Okay, now I'll flip over to the right side. This is just the pieces, that's why I used... Um, Pen to mark this. Now, this is the length of the world pocket. I came down by half inch, half an inch, and this is not more than one cm on both sides. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is to cut here open and then plant it this way and this way such that it will form this triangle. Just like this. Fold it and then you cut. Get to this point, then plant it. Okay, plant it again this way. There are still other methods of doing this, but I think this is the simplest method ever. Okay, as a beginner, it will be easy for you to do this. The essay will make it um, firm, not to be shifting around. And also this is a satin, which has the tendency of shifting around. But once you iron essay on it, it stays in place. So this is what we have. Now what we're going to do is to sew this to this point. Okay, you can flip over like this to make sure that you're sewing exactly where you cut. From this point, half inch, we sew it to this part. Take this other one and still do the same thing. So I'll go to the sewing machine now and join this together welcome back okay i've joined the two pieces together to 
the main fabric okay from this point to this point making sure that the two of them align at the same point so now you have to determine if you're going to do okay this was outside like this this was how it was fixed i need to show you okay this was how we fixed this so now and this is the right side of the fabric you have to determine if you need a well, single welt pocket or a double welt pocket. Both have the same process. It's just the arrangement that um, differentiates the two of them. Now what you're going to do is to push this inside. You're pushing it inside. The two of them goes inside. Now, I want to assume that this is the lower part of what we're making and this is the upper part where the weight size is. So, you have to determine what kind of mount you want your world pocket or the shape you want your world pocket to take. Now, if you need a single world pocket, this is the upper side. All you have to do is to make sure that this color here does not show, the pieces that you attach does not show, it's covered properly while this one is um, shifted long enough to meet with the one that is not showing okay so more like we just have one flap here okay while this enters inside you're the one to arrange it properly to make sure that everything fits in the way it should be so here we're doing a single world pocket trying to show you the difference the sewing is just the same thing depending on how wide or how big you want it to be use your hand and arrange it properly okay. so once you have arranged this the next thing is to sew it Then iron it to put it in place. Now this is for a single welt pocket, like I said before. If you need a double welt pocket, one should not um, overshadow the other. Both of them will have to come out, okay? But you need to make sure that they meet equally. So you're the one to use your hand and push it out. So this is what our double welt pocket looks like. This you have to keep on arranging it to make sure this place, this triangle here, comes out and align together. Okay, that is what will make the mount of the pocket to be together. If you secure it with a pin, then go to the ironing table. And give it a nice press then the next thing we're going to do is to make sure that we stitch this down here this small triangle here we stitch it down okay then to this one too we stitch it down and then secure this part so it and also so this part too Remove the pin. You've understood what we're doing. And also sew this part too, making sure that the mount is still the same way it is. Just like this. Bring it out and stitch it together to keep this in place. I hope you understand and please you have if you have any question, ask in the comment section. Let me know where to do better. I hope you're understanding. So, after ironing, all I'm going to do is to sew this place on this and secure the mouth so that it doesn't shift. I hope we get that. Okay, so let me go and sew it. Okay, guys, this is what our world pocket looks like. This is what our pocket looks like, the double welt pocket, okay? I hope we understand up to this point. If you have any questions, please do um, 
feel free to add now what we're going to do now is to attach a pocket to this we want to attach a pocket to this and what we want to do assuming this is the upper part we're going to attach this this way attaching it like this okay i just noticed i made a uh, mistake here i need to sew this up to this part and corner just the way this plate is so that it relaxes very well so if you notice any problem in whatever you do always um, um loosen it and do it right especially when it's for something very serious okay so in this case this is what we're going to do we have attached so this to this plate now what you have to do is either you attach this here or if this is so long that it can get to the waist of what you're sewing it's still okay so if you attach it here since it's just short if it's quite long you can still shift it to cover this um estate that is here so you can make it as long as possible so that once you iron it down it covers this but because this is short and it's just the pieces you wouldn't mind sewing it to this place so after attaching it here you can now search or weave this mount and then this place also you can trim it out and weave them together and that's why i have much allowance here so that you'll be able to finish the mount properly after sewing i hope i'm making sense so what i said was to sew here this is the pocket sew it here fold it over making sure that there is long enough to cover this or you remove this extra since it's no longer useful attach it to this other mount that is getting to the waist of whatever you're making or if it is long enough you can shift it to get to this part if this is long enough but because this is short we're leaving it at this we are sewing this and then we're going to trim this part and weave here together trim this part too and weave it together with this mount and then we are done with our weld pocket so right now you can insert your hand to cut the inside okay if it's the um, pocket that you're seeing and this is what we have okay it's in and when you flip it over you're not seeing it so here we have our double world pocket i know we also know how to do single world pocket there's one more thing pockets that have flap especially the ones you see in jackets and all that let's see how we can achieve that okay here i got a piece of fabric that i folded into two and joined by the side okay i'll open it this way you can stay it and iron it properly you have to make sure that it is the size of this um, the amount of this world pocket okay now we want to look at okay making sure that everything is normal after sewing all you have to do sorry that this is shorter than the mouth this is just a pieces i can lay my hand on so make sure that it gets to the mouth but not squeezed just to fit in properly all you have to do is to insert this inside like this okay this is the lower part this is this way And it's coming out here and all you have to do is to join it at this point 
join us here and you have your wealth pocket with plus okay you can still raise it up and insert your hand inside and cover it so we've done three types of pockets wealth pocket single wealth pocket double wealth pocket and wealth pocket with flap i hope you learned something from this video right please if you actually do learn something not minding whatever mistake you have observed please 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 and please subscribe like make a comment share do a reaction whatever you feel like doing please and please do we promise to do better as time goes on see ya bye